Hello everyone, welcome to Masa Military. The situation in the Middle East has suddenly become very tense recently, and the conflict is in danger of expanding. The Israeli Air Force, IAF, has been a vanguard in this crisis. The strength of the Israeli Air Force should be unmatched in the Middle East, and it has achieved amazing results in previous Middle East wars. The IAF has 581 military aircraft vehicles, ranking 9th out of 129 countries. The IAF has only three main fighter jets, the F-15, F-16, and the F-35 being the most advanced. It currently has 175 of various types of F-16s and 109 F-15s. In the 1950s, France became Israel's main supporter of military aircraft, and Israel acquired the Salts Mystere, Super Mystere, and Mirage 3 fighter jets. However, France declared an arms embargo against Israel on the eve of the 1967 Six-Day War, and the United States replaced France as Israel's main supplier of military aircraft. The IAF currently uses F-15 and F-16 fighters the most. Among them, the F-15 has participated in many modern wars for more than 50 years since its advent. Starting from the 1982 Lebanon War, the F-15 of the air forces of various countries have never been shot down in an air battle, and the victory-loss ratio reached an astonishing 104 to 0. More than half of the F-15's combat results were created by the Israeli Air Force. An Israeli F-15 has never been shot down in combat, but at least three have crashed during training. On June 7, 1981, Israeli F-15 fighter jets, equipped with fuel and sensor tactical packages, participated in Operation Opera. The F-15s flew 1,000 miles to provide cover for an F-16 airstrike on Iraq's Osirik nuclear facility. The most famous battle of the F-15 was the Bekaa Valley air battle between Israel and Syria in 1982. This was the largest air battle since World War II. The Israeli F-15 shot down approximately 40 Syrian military aircraft, but one of its own was almost shot down by a missile. During the air battle in the Bekaa Valley, the IAF dispatched 90 F-4s, F-15s, and F-16s, and domestically produced Kafir fighter jets as well as Mastiff UAVs, destroying 29 Syrian SA-6 surface-to-air missile systems in one fell swoop. The IAF shot down 82 to 86 Syrian fighter jets and achieved an overwhelming victory. This also resulted in Syria having to call for a ceasefire. Even the Palestine Liberation Organization was forced to admit defeat, and Israel won the Lebanon War. The Israel F-15C-D is mainly designed to compete for air supremacy. The IAF's ground attack is handled by the F-16, but the F-16's bomb load and range are insufficient. Israel's need for a long-range strike platform, capable of identifying and destroying targets threatening its borders, became apparent following the 1991 Gulf War. Since the birth of the multi-purpose F-15E Strike Eagle, Israel has wanted to acquire it, but this time it did not directly introduce it, but ordered a deeply customized version of it, the F-15I Thunder. The F-15I is a two-seat, twin-engine fighter jet measuring 63.8 feet long, 18.5 feet tall, with a wingspan of 42.8 feet, and has an empty weight of 31,967 pounds. The F-15I inherits the speed, stability, and the range of the F-15E. The F-15I's platform is equipped with many Israeli designed features. Boeing also is providing a software development facility for the F-15I. Israeli improvements include an Israeli-made central computer, a cockpit compatible with night vision goggles, the LBIT display and sight helmet system, and the AN-APG-70 radar with terrain mapping capabilities. The radar is capable of providing clear images, regardless of weather conditions and light, locating otherwise difficult to find targets, such as missile launchers, tanks, and buildings, even when completely covered by fog, heavy rain, or no light, or moonlit nights. Another important system equipped by the F-15I is the Low Altitude Navigation and Targeting Infrared System for Night, or Lantern which can capture and lock onto targets and coordinate guided munitions during the day and night. The Lantern system consists of a navigation pod and a targeting pod. The navigation pod is equipped with a forward-looking infrared night vision sensors and terrain-following radar, allowing the aircraft to fly at low altitudes and at high speeds and issue warnings of approaching obstacles. The targeting pod is equipped with a forward-looking infrared sensor for locating targets at night and a laser designator rangefinder for precise delivery 
of laser-guided munitions. Forward-looking infrared systems make it possible to track targets over long distances. The F-15I is equipped with two F-100 PW-229 engines, and also added conformal fuel tanks on both sides of the fuselage, with each a capacity of 750 gallons, plus two 610 gallon drop tanks, giving the F-15I a range of about 3,500 miles, a range that previously only bombers could achieve. The F-15I has nine weapons racks and is capable of carrying a variety of weapons, including a six-barreled 20mm M61A1 Vulcan cannon, air-to-air -air missiles, various types of guided missiles and bombs, with a bomb load of up to 23,000 pounds. Although there are only 25 F-15I fighter jets, the Thunder's capacity to lug more weapons than any other fighter makes it a crucial tool in Israel's arsenal. The F-15I's track record in Israel's history of warfare and its potential for even more significant upgrades demonstrate why it's been dubbed the country's most strategic aircraft. Okay, that's all for today. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and support Masa Military. See you next time!